very first building that was ever built on campus. So this was the origin of Iowa State back when uh, it predates the Land Grant Act. It was built in 1860 uh, as part of the state's program to create uh, the Iowa School of Agriculture and Model Farms. And then as a school continued to grow, when they created the dean's uh, position, uh, this became the home of the deans. So uh, James Wilson, uh, the head of agriculture, uh, Charles Curtis. Charles Curtis was the longest living resident of the house. He lived here for 50 years. This particular project was more of a renewal. Uh, the wallpaper in uh, the two rooms in the entry hallway, both upstairs and down, uh, were, were changed to wallpaper that more closely aligned with what we believe was, was here at the time. All of the windows were resealed, were re, uh, uh, reglazed, and the front porch. And the front porch was exciting because we were able to get a student group involved. So those three renewals, I guess, uh, remodel uh, in some respects, but, but more of a, a renewal restoration. We did a, a very careful examination of the objects we had in the house, and we tried to reinstall those objects in a thoughtful way to be a little more concise in the storytelling. This picture is from about 1907. And so this picture uh, is really what was utilized by the museum staff at the time as a touchstone, as a, a way of trying to get the interior, the, uh, the furnishings, uh, the artwork, uh, the different elements of the house to, to really come in, uh, in alignment with with what was going on at the time. It's still nice to, to know that, that the farmhouse has that sort of important uh, connection to many alums, to many people in the community, and uh, it's exciting to tell them, well, we're gonna be open again with new wallpaper and some new objects, uh, so come and see us.